私が嬉しいことはお客様にあの自分の作った料理を食べていただいて喜んでもらえるのが一番幸せです。As a chef and author, I'm always on the lookout for dishes with flavors that are intertwined with stories of people's lives and cultures. And I heard that somewhere in the corner of Metro Manila, there's a unique kind of sinigang that I should try. Chef Suzuki, Sikimashita, I'm here. Oh, oh finally! Oh, 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 finally! Please, oh, please. Oh, thank you. Yeah. How are you? How are you? Yeah. Very well. Hi, I'm Reggie Aspira. And we're here to tell you about food, culture, and a few things in between. Chef Suzuki is my tomodachi, which is the Japanese word for friend. He spent over five years in the country serving as the chef of the Japanese ambassador to the Philippines. His specialty is introducing Japanese food to foreign folks and showcasing the best of Japan. Being a foreign chef in the Philippines has its own challenges, but Chef Suzuki told me that he likes the people here. He speaks a little Filipino, well, words that are useful when he goes to the market to search for the freshest ingredients. Every day, the food is changing, and I see a lot of different foods. I eat a lot of fresh fish, and I eat a lot of fresh fish. 今夜の食材を買うためにバダルペマーケットに行ってますやっぱり日本は安定して食材は揃ってるんですけどなかなかフィリピンは食材を揃えることが難しくて、まあ、困ることもありますがよく市場の知り合いに頼んでこれを取っといてってお願いしたりとかすごいあのコミュニケーションを取りながら。なんとか食材を入手することができています。It's a familiar and friendly face to the vendors here. まああの緊張はしてますが、あのまあ今回コロナ禍でなかなかあの会食の回数が少なかったので、とても楽しみにしてます。So how long have you been in the Philippines, Chef? Uh, five five years old. Five years already? Yeah, yeah. So now that you you're here, are you happy? Are you happy to be with us? I'm very happy. What is it? <laughs> well, you should be because there's a lot about the Philippines to love, right? But what is it about being in Manila and in the Philippines that you like the most? やっぱりあのフィリピンの人はすごい明るいしあの気候もいいしあの本当に陽気ですごくコミュニケーションも取りやすいのですごくあの生活しやすいですね。広島出身でであのお好み焼きがあの有名でで最初そのお好み焼きを作るところから始まってであのお好み焼きする時はみんな家族であの家族にあの作ったりしてたのでそれで喜んでもらったっていうのも一つの,あのシェフになったきっかけです。なんか人に喜んでもらうことが好きでであのまあ料理も好きあの作ることも好きだったので。あちょっとシェフになってみようかなと思ってで専門学校行ってであのそこであのバイトをしてで働いてたところが寿司屋ででそのまま就職しました。ま、マリアージュ料理をあの考えててであのその中であのグアバシニガン、うん、でグアバシニガンはあの日本の調味料味噌と酒かす
をちょっと入れて入れたあの料理になります。Chef, I'm so excited. You're about to cook for me, and I'm going to give you my pasalubong. The pasalubong I give you, you have to put in my food, okay? Yes. Why、well, okay. you know pasalubong? Yes. Really? Yes. You put it in my food? Yes. Okay, then surprise me.、Uh, okay, let's go. All right. Wait, wait, wait. Let's finish our tea. Yeah.、First. Okay. もともと自分が食べることが好きなので美味しいものやっぱり自分も美味しいものが食べたいですし自分が食べたいものを作っていくそう,そういうことを考えてます皆さんようこそ、えー、今日はラップラップを使ってラップラップのしゃぶしゃぶの準備をしていきたいと思いますまずと頭を落としていきます新鮮な魚はまず目,目がクリア澄んでるものであとエラを見てあもうエラ取ったエラを見て色が赤い綺麗な赤色をしていたらあの鮮度がいいそれを見極めますでいろいろやり方はありますがあのお腹から中骨まで包丁の先が届いたら今度背中をさっきと同じように真ん中まで包丁がい,いったらあとはここにいるのでもっとそのフ,ィフィリピンの、あのー、食材もまだまだ知らないとは思うんで。それを使ってもっとそのあの日本とあのフィリピンの,あのマリアージュ料理をもっと開発していけたらなとは思います。It is without a doubt that Chef Suzuki is a world-class chef. But I'm curious, after being in the Philippines for five years, what ingredients have captured his imagination? これがシャブシャブ用のラップラップのさばき方になります。Chef Suzuki, what are your favorite Philippine ingredients? ラップラップ、マンゴー、カモテ。あなたの好きな日本の食材は何ですかザシ、ミリン、コンボ。Chef Suzuki, what is your favorite Filipino dish?、Uh, アドボ。シェフレジ、好きな日本食は何ですか Suzuki, yeah. Chef Suzuki, what do you think of when you see Filipino food? いろんな味付けがあって。面白いと思います。シェフレジ、あ、日本食といえばどんなことを思い浮かべますか。Fresh, pristine, delicious. Well, now you've seen a glimpse of the tricks Chef Suzuki has up his sleeve. While Chef Suzuki prepares dinner, I'll have tea with His Excellency Kazuhiko Koshikawa. Hello, I'm a Koshikawa, Japanese ambassador to the Philippines. Welcome to the Ambassador Legends. Hello. Oh, what is your experience with Chef Suzuki? How is he like as a person? How is he in the kitchen? What is he like when he's cooking?、Yeah, but, but easy to answer the question outside the kitchen. I know him very well. He's uh, uh, very cheerful, very nice guy. s Yes, very honest and sincere. It's a very important factor for the person, I think. Is he very different outside of the kitchen and inside the kitchen? Inside the kitchen, it's a quite difficult question. I have just once or twice I saw him you know, preparing dish in the kitchen, once or twice. His face is different, you know. His face was that of the professional chef. Oh, not laughing. No, 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 no. s <laughs> preparing. Serious. Yeah, serious. Professional chef, I think. I will ask him why you stay longer, you know, five years. It, he, he, he told me that, I don't know, I don't say I love Philippines, but he likes Philippines very much. He's fond of Philippines. That's, that's his answer. But this time he had brought his family and the wife and the daughter.、Yes. So I think he decided to stay longer, I think. <laughs> But let me say my first encounter with the Philippine cuisine dish is in Tokyo.、Mm, 15 years ago, I was invited by the Philippine ambassador station in Tokyo to his residence. And、uh, that was the、uh, Sinigang. That is my first dish、uh, in the Philippines I encountered in Japan. 
right. So, is there anything else aside from sinigang that you like? Uh, Have you tried? I'm sure you've tried our adobo. Adobo, yes. And uh, do you like it? In, do you like it with chicken or with pork? Oh, just I tried adobo, chicken adobos. Yes, I think it's a uh, it's a very Philippine. I think you know uh, the taste is quite thick. Uh, uh, can I say? Uh, and uh, it's better to eat with rice. It's a good to know uh, this for for the rice. Uh, yes, right, 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 exactly. And also, yes, in Japan, we're the same, you know. Our cuisine is not a purely Japanese you know, uh, creation. It's uh, an encounter with many other foreign uh, cuisine, the food, uh, through our histories. Chef Suzuki, with his food, as he is with life, is very adventurous. So the challenge I gave him was not really a challenge. But an invitation to experiment. So, chef, what are we cooking? So, we're cooking sinigang, and for the sinigang, we have the. Oh, yeah. I brought my fish sauce because I like my sinigang with fish sauce. Oh, yes. What else are you cooking? Oh, onigiri. Oh, this oh, one yeah. for onigiri. Too, yeah, right? very good. Do you, do yes. you know what this is? What? Jiris. Jiris. Yeah, it's oh, called jiris. Yeah. And then this one. What is it? 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 自分うん、Chef Suzuki did his magic. He whipped up a menu that fused the best of Philippine and Japanese cuisine. The dishes told a story of his journey as a chef who's always honing and sharpening his craft to perfection. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, I heard so many things about this. Yeah, yeah. So now she has so much high expectations, so you know that. High lazy expectations. Very, very high. No, but you did not disappoint. Your first year appetizers were excellent. Ah, thank you so much. Yeah. まあ、<笑> あの、努力は実るとこういう The day ended in the midst of good company, hearty laughter, and fine food. Every dish Chef Suzuki prepared was a work of art that satisfied the buds in a way that is unique to Suzuki-san as a culinary artist. Oh, and that guava sinigang was no exception. <laughs> Each I'm bite happy. was personal, <laughs> for it was cooked by Suzuki-san, a Japanese chef who has fallen in love with the flavors yeah. of the Philippines. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. Hello, I'm Chef Suzuki. Hi, I'm Chef Reggie. 